The goal for the project, uh, this first phase of the project, was to stabilize the building. Uh, there was significant damage done to the roof structure and the tension ring that supports the base of the roof. Uh, when a tree fell on the roof uh, a number of years ago, and so the objective was to stabilize the building, give us some time to uh, complete design, put together a complete restoration package. What we've done is we've gone up, gone up and gone all the way to the underside of the structure and held it in place. It can't go down, let's put it that way. And it was in failure mode, it was starting to collapse. They developed a plan to create a steel, structural steel platform inside the gas holder, spanning the whole floor, resting on a center brick column. And then from there, they created these massive uh, shoring towers that went up to the midpoint of the 16 main rafters, and they picked up the weight off of the, off the tension ring at the midpoint of those 16 rafters. We have cribbing piles that we've set up on top of the shoring towers with blocks of wood and those blocks of wood carry a triangular shaped block of wood that fills in the space between the sloping rafter and the top block on the cribbing pile. But you're not really trying to get into a position where you're lifting the roof. What you want to do is you want to stabilize it so it can't come down anymore. So as any uh, relaxation or failure of that structure continues to happen, it's going to be on those posts so that it can't fall, can't collapse on itself. Part of our contract was to not only stabilize the structure, but to waterproof the existing roof and to board up the windows. A lot of the windows were broken already and they just wanted to get the building tight. The key part now is that uh, the building's stable um, and we can develop, develop the final plans for the rest, complete restoration of the building and uh, work to raise all of the funds necessary to do so.